the global uh, scenario for quarter two which is the june quarter uh, demand was down 12 percent um, largely uh, the drop has been in india and china they are the big buyers as you are aware uh, india is 25 percent down um, and that's large again due to uh, softness in the rural demand and uh, you know many investors probably uh, finding equity a uh, better option in the quarter two but uh, we still uh, maintain that the uh, second half for the uh, for the indian demand will be much higher than the last year uh, so uh, china too was uh, lower uh, in quarter two but uh, uh, overall the biggest drop in this quarter came from india uh, it's it uh, the drop was more across uh, the sectors jewelry and investment both saw a decline in demand for this quarter well india as you know accounts for 25 to 30 percent of the global demand and china a similar number so between the two countries uh, they account for 50 to 60 percent it varies between one year and the other um, that's what uh, the size of these two countries demand for gold is and this is physical gold um, what we are talking about here uh, so and this is driven by millions of people buying households in both the countries um, very similar um, you know uh, trends that we see um, this uh, uh, year we expect the total demand from India to be in the region of 900 to 1000 we speak in calendar year we expect 900 to 1000 uh, the first half has been 347 tons for India uh, as for China, we expect a similar figure 900 to 1000, but China's first half demand has been much higher than India at 494 tons. Uh, so which means that you will see that both the countries will have the second half better than the first half and the second half better than the respective second half of the last year. Uh, but both countries again uh, have uh, seen um, that uh, the demand has been a little slower for varied reasons in China it is uh, again due to the fact that the uh, stock markets are very very attractive in the second quarter and also the general softness in the economic growth in India rural demand affected uh, this first half and the second quarter in particular and uh, bars and coins uh, demand which is the investment demand was affected because again equity markets are better and people are a lot more cautious uh, optimistic uh, in the last uh, the second quarter as you know smuggling was uh, quite uh, uh, rampant uh, in 2013 and 14 particularly after the 80 20 rule was uh, introduced um, it was also uh, aggravated by the 10 percent duty so both these factors contributed to make smuggling a very very um, uh, what thriving uh, part of the supply and we have highlighted this issue um, what we saw uh, in 2015 in the first half is that after the removal of 80 20 uh, last year around uh, the quarter two after the new government uh, came in um, smuggling has come down certainly um, last year we estimated smuggling to be around 175 tons largely in the first half this year we expect it to be significantly lower we still don't have an estimate yet uh, we will do it for the full year but uh, from the indications that have uh, we have collected in our market survey this seems to be substantially significantly lower in 2015